Hey guys, in this video I'm going to talk about the accordion element. Now in case you don't know what it looks like, just go to the elements accordions and you should find the, all the four styles included. So um, this one right here, the style 4 is uh, actually the latest, it's included uh, from the versions uh, 4 and we have the three styles that were always uh, included in the theme so basically uh, these are the elements I'm going to edit this page with a page builder so you can uh, see all the options of the accordion and as you can see right here we can edit adjust a style right here we can lively live lively yeah we can change the options live <laughs> and dynamically for example style 1 style 2 3 and 4 we can change the collapse uh, behavior for example right now it's toggle this means this one for example is opened and if I click this one this they will both be opened and perhaps you just want an, a simple accordion effect for example if I change to accordion and I'm going to close as you can see the first one has closed so the others are um, closing uh, as well great so um, moving on with the rest of the options actually the rest of the options are the accordion paints so we can add uh, as many uh, accordion paints uh, as we want we can delete them we can move them around we can clone them and we can edit the options now uh, as you can see right here there are only two options and I will explain you why uh, this is the title which will appear right here into the uh, pane uh, bar and you can specify whether you want the uh, pane to be collapsed or uh, expanded so I'm just going to leave it as uh, no I'm going to save it and the interesting part of the um, uh, this element is that you can uh, add custom page builder elements inside their paints this is a very cool feature and um, basically you have all the freedom to do some crazy stuff I wouldn't recommend too crazy stuff uh, too much crazy crazy stuff just keep it simple uh, keep uh, constantly remind yourself you have uh, hidden content and you shouldn't rely too much uh, on this so for example on a, a frequently uh, asked questions this is perfect for some text for some simple stuff it's okay but try not to hide uh, something that's important it's, uh, it's very important not to hide it because I don't know it just not is not uh, okay from a user experience and friendliness uh, point of view so basically the rest are exactly the same only the style is different like I said you can uh, change the style uh, live and that's about it to, to simply add a new accordion uh, element just I don't know let's just say section and I'm just going to add the accordion element great so let me just say yeah style one So as you can see right here 
1 and 2 and this one is opened and has a column inside. Now for example you want to add a simple text box with like I said text, simple text. I have this corporate Ipsum uh, extension which generates some text. I'm just going to save it. As you can see this is an element inside and then for this one you can uh, let me see I don't have a contact let me just open I know sorry about that just quick uh, just a quick save anyway sorry for about that if you just want to add another text just simply drag it into the other pane so this is the uh, accordion element uh, if you have any questions or uh, if you need assistance feel free to subscribe to our uh, support forums and my colleagues will uh, assist you there so thanks for watching and see you in the next one